Hello everybody, how are you today? Excellent. Okay, so today's lesson uh, is about ads and posters. Yes, ads and posters. Advertising and posters. Because we are going to need to do, we are going to do a poster. So, let's have a look at how they look like, how they could be made, and at the end of the lesson we could make one. Good. Let's start with these three examples. The first one is uh, amazing, is yeah, is very good, yes. Uh, okay, at the bottom of the picture, of the poster, we see have a hand, and at the, at the top we see four chimneys. They look like the fingers, yes, excellent. So, and it says stop pollu stop pollution greenpeace okay so the message the message is is in your hands is in your hands to stop pollution uh, yes good excellent amazing and the second one is similar two penguins well one penguin pulling out the cable and the plug so you cannot contaminate so much and the message, the headline, the title is, is, it is, turn it off now. Okay, so don't consume so much light, don't pollute. Okay, and the third one is a, is a bag, is, is a paper bag, but is, is, it looks like a poster. It could be an ad. The message is, the headline is, give me your hand. And it shows you an animal. Okay, with your uh, with uh, its um, arm stretched, yes. And when you take the hand, the hand when you take the back, sorry, it looks like you're giving the hand to the animal. Okay, you're holding hands, so it's it's very good too. Give me your hand, Greenpeace. Help the animals, Greenpeace. Okay, excellent. That's a very good one. Okay, so the ads and posters have five parts, five parts that you can easily differentiate. But not all the ads you can see have all these five parts. But we're going to do a poster with all these five parts. The first part, the headline. The headline is a short uh, line of words. We can see that later. The second part is the illustration, the picture, the image, the drawing, yes. The third part is the copy with a um, longer message, with a uh, longer test, giving information. And the fourth and fifth are the signature, the names of the company, the name of the, the people who is doing this poster, and a logo about these people a logo for this company okay so let's have a look at these five parts in detail the logo is a little image that looks like a symbol for the brand for example in this poster in this image in this ad here if you can if you have a look there is a little image a red um, image yes yeah, and it's the symbol of this Mitsubishi car, yes, of the Mitsubishi cars. So, and the the poster says little when it has some test, but the strong thing is the image using the rhino, like a very strong animal, the very strong car, and it gives you the, uh, the, the bit of image with color, and it's the logo. Everything in black and white, but this is logo in color we have we can see many 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 logos around us every day if you have a look if you take her I mean you take look uh, take a look at the logos around you you will find hundreds maybe every day so maybe if you look at the cars around your street you can find these for different brands or if you like Marvel superheroes you can remember the Superman logo or the Batman logo or the Captain America logo. Yes, those are logos, little images that identify some people, some brand, some company. Good. The headline, as we've seen in the first image, is a line of words that explain the most important thing about the product. So, 
here the message is think before you write okay and this is a nice message for everybody think before you write good simple or here share a code with a friend yes this is um, uh, an advertising for a soda drink and each bottle have a name has a name so you can share with a friend this is a friend and another friend and sharing a drink with a friend this is a nice headline too and then we have the illustration the illustration is the arts photo or picture used to show the product sometimes important things about the product for example in this picture in the middle it's very easy to understand that the tomato ketchup here in this bottle with the shape of the bottle is made of tomato slices of tomato this is a very good image this is a great image illustration and here uh, we can see an, Im uh, an image split in two the right, left, uh, left hand side it looks like a very young woman and on the right like an old woman okay so this image is used to show you the benefits the magic thing about this cream if you use this cream on your face you won't look like this you will look like this okay so be careful with this type of advertising because sometimes are deceitful they don't tell always the truth okay do you, do you really think that this is gonna happen this difference could happen easily with just one cream I don't think so neither very good the copy is the test that explains more characteristics about the product so for example here we have the illustration we have the headline and then here we have more information about the food that is uh, advertised in this ad or poster here in all this area we have a lot of test of words that explain the things about these um, computer okay the signature the signature is the name of the company which advertises the product okay for example in this art we have sofa sale so this shop sells sofas yes and the name of the of the of the shop is here Jimbo's outlet and also the signature sometimes it gives you the information about the telephone yes so where you can contact them and also the address where you can find them yes Broadway Plain Town New York so this is the street yes good and yes sometimes the signature is with the e logo you put the logo at the bottom of the art of the poster to sign like a signature okay so at the bottom of the sa of the poster of the art is usually where you can find the signature good okay so all the ads are created to sell us sell us things or yes yeah, things so be very careful with things you read in an ad because sometimes they say and show things that they are not complete uh, completely true okay they're deceitful I remember these these ad or even these ad okay here they say that this is a balanced diet balanced diet oh my god I see fat and fat and low fat here yes and this is balancing everything here no 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 this is not really a good balanced diet okay so you need to be critic critic think about and ask yourself is this true or is it trying to trick me yes should I buy this or this is not entirely true okay good some examples about the posters and ads yes this is for a summer holiday and this is in in UK so they use the double decker bus from London they give you the telephone the address for the um, website this is a nice 
headline, yes. All is here, the illustration, everything is nice. And the logo and the contact details, the signature, very good. Here we have the logo, the, the illustration, uh, the headline, the copy, okay, you have the copy here, yes, good. This is, oh cool, this is an example of how the simple could be. This is the, the, in, the, the illustration, the burger that is announced in the advert, like this one. But when you buy, you, when you go to the shop and buy one, a real one, it looks like this. Or even like this. Oh my god, what a big difference between these shown in the posters or in the ads. And, and these, okay, the real one. So be careful because sometimes the ads give you surprise. Surprises. Okay, this is a very uh, not crea non creative, I must say, poster an exa an, as an example for you to create for your English con uh, speak English sp speaking country. Okay, I made a w I made one for Spain. The headline is Visit Spain, Great Peaches and Amazing Food. This is the headline, and then the illustration is. Complex one, two, three, and four parts of an illustration. Okay, then the copy, where I give the information. Okay, all this is information about the, the the country. And then at the end, I may I put a logo, an image, and also the signature with the name of the company or this the country in this occasion. Good. So you're going to do a poster about your English speaking country and remember you have to use uh, a headline and uh, create an illustration think about a copy with some information and the signature uh, saying who you are and the logo maybe yes about you know your country maybe the flag or you can make up one of yourself so you have all the information to create a poster and we are ready to start. See you later.